Hi, welcome to Hilltop Camper and RV. I'm Marcel, here to show you the 2022 Red Hawk, Jayco Red Hawk 31F. The 31F is a great family uh, motor coach with some bunks, and we'll see that when we go on the inside. Just want to show you a few things here on the outside that uh, Jayco does a little different than some of the other manufacturers. Number one is they use a one-piece fiberglass cap. Why is that important? Well, the nice thing is there's no seam. So when you're traveling down the road, the most abuse coming here during a rainstorm or whatever is gonna affect those seams here and eventually that caulk's gonna break down and you're gonna get leakage in here. No way water is getting in here. One piece fiberglass cap from Jayco. Some other things here they got is uh, side view cameras prep for side view. Actually, it's ready to go for side view cameras and backup camera. You do have some outdoor speakers. You have awning lights, great LED awning lights underneath this huge awning. Moving on towards the back of the coach, you do have some storage in here. If you'll notice also too, Jayco gives you a gas port down below here. So if you did want to hook up a uh, outside grill or griddle, you got gas connection right there. Got some storage in the back here. Another thing back here with Jayco is roof ladder, getting up to inspect your roof, do any work on the roof. Also, Towability, 7,500 pounds is what this is capable of towing. Does have your connections back here to be able to add a brake controller and your seven pin plug. Go inside and take a look around. And now we're gonna take a look at the inside of the uh, 31F Red Hawk here. All Class C is normally gonna have a bunk over cab if there's not storage up here. And this one, it is the bunk over cab with a 750 pound weight rating. New for 2022 is the cargo net they put in here. Kids aren't gonna fall out of bed. Uh, very easy to uh, take it down, get it out of the way. Obviously do have a ladder as well for the kids to get up there. That's very easy to get out of the way as well. The two cushions you see up front are for the seats. They do rotate so you can be sitting back facing this way. Those will boost you up six inches so your knees aren't in your face and gives you a good seating position. Dinette can turn into a uh, bed as well. Very simple to Detach that from the wall, that just swings down to its resting place underneath. You put the cushions in, you got another bed there. Behind me is the couch, that jackknifes. So again, more sleeping if need be. One thing you'll notice is seat belts. Jayco is big on putting a seat belt in every seated position, even the rear facing dinette, which is not required. Jayco does not want you to be choosing which child is more important than the other, that who gets a seat belt and who doesn't. So. Seat belts in every position. Moving back to the kitchen area here, we have a, a nice eight cubic foot refrigerator. It's a two way gas electric fridge. A beautiful pantry right next to it to store plenty of goodies. Kitchen area, good counter space. You have your power tower where you got your plug-ins and your uh, USB ports right there. More cabinetry here. Uh, microwave oven up here. Plenty of uh, pot and pan storage down below your oven here. Moving towards the back, you got two single bunks back here. Kids just love those. The one thing is this is all a super slide on the wall here. So that's gonna all come in. You will not be able to access, access the bedroom through the hallway here, but the beauty is, is you do have a door through the bathroom so you can access the bedroom going down the road if you want to uh, lay down back there. Beautiful bathroom in the back. Beautiful queen bed back here in the bedroom with some great storage underneath the bed and plenty of cabinetry and storage behind uh, in front of the bed here as well with drawers and wardrobe closet. On Jayco's Class C motorhomes, they do what's called J-Ride and J-Ride Plus. On the Red Hawk is J-Ride, which does a few different things to this chassis. So when they get this chassis from Ford, before they start to do any building on it, they add Helwig helper springs. They do a heavy duty rear stabilizer bar. They put jounce bumpers between the chassis and the uh, coach build itself. And then they have to stretch the drive shaft and then they balance that all as one piece instead of two pieces and one, they balance all three pieces together. What that does for you is give you a very quiet, good handling ride. Encourage you to come take a Red Hawk for a test drive and test drive some others and you'll see what the J-Ride is all about. Thanks for watching and hope to see you soon.